Hey, what's going on guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Welcome to another episode of The Body Beatdown with me, Michael, your insane host. So we're going to try and keep this video kind of short and sweet. Today is Monday. It's my leg day. And today I'm going to do some free weight squats, which I've not done since 2015. And even then I only done a couple of times because I cannot reach back and hold the bar for crap because my shoulders are just that bad. With the weight being light, I can somewhat do it. But once I start getting heavy weight and trying to control that bar and trying to control my back and the stabilizing muscles and doing the, uh, the proper form and technique, it goes uh, really bad. So uh, for those of you that like to uh, complain about Smith machines and other type machines like that, see, they have their place. Now, they're for people like myself, and they're also for people who like to incorporate machines anyways into their normal training, even if they have problems or not. So, uh, Smith machines and any other type of equipment like that is uh, uh, a wonderful thing to have in your arsenal. And if it wasn't for a Smith machine, I wouldn't be getting to squat. So, you're going to see me... Uh, trying to do 135 I'm gonna do four sets or five I think five sets of 135 just getting to you you know getting used to the movement and uh, the pain and uh, you're gonna see the look on my face most likely uh, it's bad enough whenever I use a Smith machine okay not only do I have a chronic bad back which makes me want to vomit every day but I also have a bad neck it's always stiff it's always sore i'm always i turn like this I, you know i'm i'm sore i have a bad neck it goes along with a bad back i was in construction just short story here i know we're two minutes in already short quick story i was in construction for 15 years uh we were building my at the time my brother-in-law's house and uh we left a piece of four by eight sheathing off the floor so we could come in and out of the house with ease and uh you know the house is all dried up and we were doing drywall and all kind of good stuff and there was 12 sheets of drywall stacked against the wall i was coming up out from under the house i was up on my knees my brother-in-law stepped on the drywall the drywall fell over on my forehead boom like so about completely killed me and uh so that probably had a lot to do with why my neck is the way it is uh he was he was on a ladder and that and put his foot over on it he was doing some drywall and finishing up you know doing some mud and stuff and his foot was on there and the whole stack fell over on my head 12 foot long four foot tall half inch thick uh, 12 pieces of drywall fell directly on my forehead with me up on my knees under the house uh i managed to work still for a little while after that even though i was in some of the most severe pain i've ever felt in my life concussion whiplash pulled muscles everything I went to the doctor, uh, to the hot ER, and they said, it, it, you got everything. So I was out of work for a good week. I had a horrible headache for an entire week, and uh, it was some extreme pain. So between that and my chronic bad back and, uh, you know, my shoulders are not good because of bad lifts and also playing disc golf, if you've ever played that, I destroyed this arm completely, even more so. So I got a lot of ailments that are not just ailments, but they're like extreme pain ailments. So long story short, that was not really a, a short story at all. This is where I'm at right now. 2015, I tried to work out again. I got a gym membership. It's the first time I ever done that. And uh, it ended up, I couldn't do a whole lot. I was going and I was enjoying myself, but at the same time I was in so much pain with everything I was doing that I eventually within the year I broke my contract and uh, started cycling and then I cycled for five and a half years and uh, I was also able to just over a year ago start training again because I'm less in pain so I'm sorry for the four and a half minute opening but let's get on to some free weight squats my form is gonna suck it's gonna be bad but we're gonna show you this and then I'm gonna go next door to my other part of my gym and I'm gonna do some more legs so let's do this guys all right like I said we are only doing 135 and uh, let's see if we can get this done 
I'm gonna try to set facing this way and then try to set facing this way. I don't know exactly how I need to turn. So, we got those 10 done. Now the hardest part for me on that is letting go of the bar and letting all that pressure off my shoulders. Whew. Whew. Painful guys. It felt okay while I was doing them. Uh, it didn't feel too bad or out of control. Uh, we'll do another video of the next set and just kind of get a different angle so I can kind of see how I'm doing. Uh, squats have always been my worst movement for the reasons that I mentioned. So let me rest up, catch my breath just for a second and uh, we'll do another set guys. All right guys, let's get this set here from the side so I can kind of get a look at things. Man, as far as the squatting actually goes, it feels really good. I know it's only 135. <clears throat> but I feel like I'm I feel like I'm doing pretty decent with the movement. Again, it's my worst movement uh, out of anything I do. Woo! Oh my my. Oh, anyway, I'm gonna carry on with my leg workout today I want to continue using this through my whole leg workout but again I kind of have it to where I'm gonna do five sets with this and then I'm gonna go into the main gym over there and uh, do five sets with the Smith and then I'm gonna do some dumbbell deadlifts which I enjoy so anyway guys hey uh, like share subscribe comment all that good stuff to the body beat down I appreciate it I'm sorry for the long intro but I kind of wanted to explain some things and there's a lot of new people in here that don't know anything about me really so that's a uh, kind of a big story of mine uh, so anyway please uh, if I'm trying to inspire you that's great and if I am that's great inspire me in the comments guys let me know your stories let me know if you're working out maybe your worst movements that you do uh, any real ailments that you have not like oh, I jam my finger, but like real life-changing uh, Ailments that you go through on a daily basis that uh, can really hinder you and hold you back and that you want to share with the world 
uh, please leave it in the comments and let us know what's going on because uh, a lot of us that go through these things can really sympathize and uh, help you you know with at least encouraging words so uh, anyway uh, I'm gonna get my leg workout going on get it done get my supper ate I'm eating a nice healthy supper as usual and uh, we're gonna continue on this day guys all right get up get out get red do it to it did I mess that up did I mess my own outro up get up get out get red do it to it we'll see you later on the body beat down Get up, get out, get ran, and do it, do it!